<laughs> wow! <laughs> I don't even say anything and immediately you just shout the word. <laughs> yeah, that, yeah, that is the joke, oh. Golden. Thank you for explaining it. Oh, welcome to part two of <laughs> Golden Fox Plays, where I continue with Donkey Kong Country. We have the same people as before. Uh, babe, you were saying about uh, that one Scooby-Doo game? Yeah, Play Mystery Mayhem. Stay away from Unmask because it's a poopy pile of garbage shit. <laughs> Are you sure that was the game you were talking about? No, no, Mystery Mayhem's the really fun one. But Scooby-Doo on Mass was the last GameCube game, and it sucked ass because you couldn't play as Shaggy, you barely saw the other gang, there was no story, and the entire mechanic was Scooby wore these different disguises that gave him superpowers, and it's like, I don't care. This is not fun. I don't want fun. The most I remember, like the one Scooby game I definitely remember renting and playing was Night of a Hundred Frights. That one and I it's... love. No, go ahead. No, I was just going to. No, I was just agreeing with you. I said I like. I really like that game. It. It. I sort of liked. I guess. I miss the laugh track from like original Scooby. Like it, it kind of helped. It it helped add a little bit of charm to it, and they threw it in the game. And I'm like, this is cute. But then they overdid it. I think at some point, so I'm like, this is not cute. Whoa. I agree with you there, but I do like the fact that all the monsters are actually um, characters from oh, I missed. Where Are You and stuff. Oh shit! Yeah. So it says, says, oh my god, it's Mr. Jenkins. Oh my god, it's Mr. Jenkins. Oh my god, it's Mr. Jenkins. <laughs> oh my god, it's Mr. Jenkins. Oh my god, it's Bob. Like have an introduction or no? <laughs> now, the, the one thing that um, there was, there was one thing that always fucking pissed me off about Night of a Hundred Frights, and that was you could kill every other goat, every other you know monster, except the fucking phantoms. No matter what you do, they don't die, and they will always hurt you. And it's like, I- and then there's like, near the end of the game, there's like oh, 15 nice. phantoms in one room, and it's like, God damn it! Oh, it's one of these. There's an unpredictable Anyways, nature. Anyways, intro. We, intro. We started with penis, and then we started talking about Scooby-Doo games. Yep, we did. Yeah. Oh shit! I remember also. Come on, having, fuck him! Um, Woohoo! Are are we having... still on the next episode or? Yeah, we are. Yeah. On the next episode. Okay. I, well I then. I remember also having the Cyber <laughs> Chase game on PlayStation. Oh god, that was one of the bad ones I played. I never got past the um the Greek level. Oh my god. Oh shit! <laughs> wow! It's like, oh shit, I gotta take, get rid of this wheel. Oh shit, I'm over a pit. Goodbye, cruel world. It was nice knowing you. <laughs> Why don't you just walk yourself off a cliff next time? Oh wait. <laughs> get rid of the barrel first before I jump over the cliff. When I told leg. you to walk off a cliff, I didn't mean literally. What? Th when did you say that? No, I'm gonna quote something. <clears> hmm. <throat> Go jump off a balcony! What? Stop him! Stop him! Want me to sting him? What's but off? he's a Pegasus, he can just fly. Fine. But remember, oh, be I yourself. Yeah, right. The Golden, you strike me as the sort of person who would, like, innocently forget you can fly until halfway through the fall. It's like, ah! Oh, wait. <laughs> I no, no, I got, yeah, I got a better one. Golden comes up to say hi to Bliss, who's just... Settled on a cloud and he forgot to take off his nurse outfit. Fuck! Like, Goldie, your, your flake is showing under your red pink skirt. He's like, wait, what? Oh shit, I forgot to take it off! And I boop him and he, his wings just shut and he just drops to the ground. <laughs> I like that when he's flying, they will shut instead of stay open. <laughs> they, they will just shut. <laughs> oh, what? No, it's just like. Golden, you're naked! Oh, wait, we're always naked. <laughs> oh, I jumped right into that one. Hey, 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 Toon. What? What's your least favorite Power Rangers character? My least favorite Power Rangers character has to be... 
Mac, the Red Ranger from Operation Overdrive. He is one of the whiniest Red Rangers I've ever seen, and quite possibly the worst, second only to Troy from Megaforce. Oh! This dude, this dude was so generic, I think is the word. There was nothing interesting or exciting about him. But halfway through the series, we discover that he's actually a robot created by his father, what? and he never he never had a kid so he raised um he he raised this robot but yet he built him as an adult and implanted fake memories into him and when he found out that he was a robot he got all angsty and bitchy and refused to be a power ranger and help his team out and even though he changed he was still fucking whiny and uninteresting the entire time this and i'm just like dude like shut the fuck up astro boy I know, and he was so passive aggressive about it. Oh, this why sounds, should I listen to you for advice? You know, this sounds like freaking Anakin Skywalker from Attack of the Clones. I mean, it's no, just like as animals. bad too. And I slaughter them like animals. I hate them. No, that's not even the worst part. It was before then. It's uh, there's something <laughs> right, Spock. He's jealous. It's something not like that. Like that is coarse, rough, coarse and, and rough. Weird, weird. Oh, I'm like you. Remember, remember, Peter, when we were walking oh. back and after dinner, we all had that we had that fucking Star Wars moment. Um, I think I do remember that. That was uh, was that the night we tried to go to like Steelers, but we couldn't. Yeah, I remember that. Yeah. Okay. Okay. So, uh, ask Safi. Do I imagine you and Manga Common Ice King? Just because I'm picturing in my head right now. Actually, funny thing. Oh. Common, Common. I asked him like, "Hey, Common, would you ever ice skate?" And he's like, "No, the tights are too tight and go up my crotch." <laughs> then I asked so, him, like, he's oh, moose question, knuckle. Like, "Would you do it with another man?" He's like, "No, no, Christy, no." Like, oh, okay. damn it. Manga yeah, Common the Moose Knuckle would be his ice skating me. I, I would have seen Manga Common in an ice skating outfit, and it must be tight. <laughs> wow. Okay, so this is a question Damn right. For... What's up, what's up, Key? I guess this is a question for um, everyone here. Of all the fictional characters you've experienced in your life, who are the what is your least favorite fictional character? The one that get, grinds your gears whenever you talk hear about him. Uh, um, I'll start with I, I may have to think on. about it. I, gotta... I can tell you mine. Oh boy. Sure. My least my least favorite fictional character. Um, <laughs> I didn't hear that. It's all of them because they're all not real, and I want them to be my friends. Uh, no. Even uh, the jerky ones. Even the jerky ones. <laughs> um, no. All I'm right, all right. My... How about this? Charmy the bee is my least favorite. Oh, don't get uh, me hold fucking on. started, <laughs> Guys, hold on Go a ahead, second. Key. Um, Metal Forge, can we not talk about Force Awakens? Yeah, he he's. Like, he's one of the people who really do not like Force Awakens, and he gets way over the top about it. Anyway, oh, um, well, yes. nobody wants to hear anybody's rants, especially when we don't agree with you. Blah. <laughs> no, oh. I'm kidding. Mm -hmm. I'm kidding! Go, Go ahead. Go ahead, Key. My least favorite fictional character is probably... Uh... Ren from Ren and Stimpy. During the adult part party... Adult party cartoon days. Oh boy. He was at least tolerable in the original cartoon. Actually, modern Spongebob, like, uh, Patrick, I, I don't like him. He's just turned into a jerk at this point. At least, like, the last I remember it. Mm, I don't like Huh? That. Your least favorite fictional character? Um, Anakin Skywalker. Really? Yeah. Oh, the game gave me another chance. Awesome. Don't fuck it up. Yeah. I know Zack's least favorite character is probably uh, 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 Shadow the Hedgehog. No, actually, it's Charmy. Charmy can fuck off. What is Charmy? <laughs> Charmy the Bee is a member of the of the Chaotix team, and he's an annoying little shit who should never have been created. 
Do you have an annoying uh, uh, fictional character you don't like, Peter? Yeah, there are a few. I'm trying to think of who, though. They're they're so bad that he had to lock it away in his memory forever, they're just and he forest. doesn't want to remember it. <laughs> no, no, I'm legitimately trying to remember because I'm drawing a blank. But I I get the feeling that once this call or discussion ends, I'm gonna suddenly remember who it is and why. You're gonna, <laughs> just you're gonna be driving home and then you're like, damn it! Fuck! <laughs> <laughs> Pretty I much. Just <laughs> No, I'll be thinking about it at work, because at work, I just have to monitor a machine, so my mind wanders, and I'll just be like, what is, what is, shit. Right? <laughs> I, the same thing happens to me whenever I'm at work. Like, my, one, my mind wanders over, like, so many projects that I have yet to work on, but as soon as I get back, I'm like, I don't feel as motivated. It's, it's crazy. All right. No, no, that's, that's always how it is, because it's something you'd rather be doing than work. So, huh. of course, you have the energy during it, but then when you get home, you, you're you allowed to be lazy, so your brain will usually opt to be lazy. God. I don't really have that problem for some reason. Well, that's because you, your a projects are your work. That's why. Oh, is that it? Yeah. No, 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 I would say your, pro your projects are your work, that's why you don't really have it. Yeah. Because, like... Because, like, saying that your projects are your work or that you do or don't have the motivation to do the same thing is kind of... It's not really the same question, if you oh, ask me. Here's an interesting question. What are your guys' favorite fictional spaceships? Uh, Millennium uh, Falcon. Millennium Falcon. I would say the X-Wing. Uh, Definitely the Millennium Falcon. Oh, come on! Yeah. Wait, I, wait, 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 wait. I take it back. Hold on. No. Oh, fuck. So I don't know. Also, I would have to say uh, one of my favorite ships is the Wave Rider from Legends of Tomorrow. Ask Safi, most emotional cartoon moment in my opinion. The time when Pikachu cried over Dash over Ash's Dash. dead corpse. Dash! Dash. Yes, Rainbow, Rainbow Dash. Dash. Wake up, Rainbow Dash. Wake up, Rainbow um, Dash. Anyways, babe, you were saying? You were saying? I was I was saying the Millennium Falcon or um does the TARDIS count as a spaceship? Yeah, the TARDIS is a spaceship. What yeah, the hell is well, the TARDIS? The, the thing Doctor Who Doctor Who. In the box. All right, well, I don't Doctor Who, so. I yeah, I don't Doctor either, but even I knew that. But Dang. I got one more. I got one okay, more. Okay, when I think of it, I think know. of it as the shush, phone. Shush, shush, you're talking over bliss. Okay, whatever. I was just saying, one shit that probably a whole lot of people don't know about is uh, Moya. Moya? From? Moya from Farscape. A oh, living ship. Game. Yeah, the living ship, Moya. Literally a giant whale that lives out in space. Yeah, okay, so... I'm, I'm just going to say, like, the uh, ship, I forget its name, from, uh, friggin' bleh. Damn it. Uh, from Sonic no! the Sonic Adventure. What was that ship the that's space in the sky? In. Yep, that's the one. That's not Wait, a guys. ship, though. That's a satellite. We are forgetting about care. the greatest it spaceship counts. ever space. created. What is that, mm -hmm. like? The TARDIS. That's we already no, said it. The TARDIS, the TARDIS was mine. You troglodyte. Yeah, and speaking <laughs> of that... No, you know what really is the best spaceship? The what? fucking little Einstein spaceship, motherfucker. Oh, As shut up. Out. The movie spaceship. Our favorite rocket ship. Soaring through the sky. So back to what I was saying about the whole TARDIS thing. Why don't people just call it phone booth? It's much easier for the casual viewers to remember. Did you just call it a TARDIS? <laughs> Tartarus. <laughs> okay, Tartarus, Tartarus. These sound similar, they're spelled similarly, okay? Oh, 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 throw oh, me a freaking oh, bone here. One has a well, D one is a, the other no, one no, 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 no. Golden, I would, I would hope that you wouldn't confuse the two because one is Greek hell and the yes, other I is Yes, I know what booth. it is. <laughs> Can I make a really off-color joke? Death. Yes. If you... <laughs> Tartarus with Tartarus, you are retarded. <laughs> are you saying that I'm retarded? Oh, I said no. That's I, mean. I, was, I asked for permission for an off-color joke, and you guys granted it to me. You don't groan at me. Yeah, yeah, but... <laughs> when, I thought, when you said off-color, I thought you meant something else. What, a racist joke? 
What else do you think color <laughs> refers to? The sky is green instead of blue? What the fuck? The sky is Mountain Dew. Oh my gosh. Where do we go to from obviously, here, people? Obviously, obviously, Brett, the sky is Mountain Dew Baja Blast. Oh, that's good. Yeah, yes. I knew it. That would make everything so much better, because then when it rains, you just run outside and be like, I'm sticky. <laughs> 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 I'm sticky. <laughs> what? You can just do that any time of day, Peter. Oh, come on! I think you need a slow. I need to think. Bleh. I remember getting through this level easily when I took my time on the rope. I did just keep going up and down and up and down. I, I waited for everything to come on screen the last second. Yeah, try like try to go like keep try, try taking your time when you have a shit ton of enemies who are just like coming your way. I did. It still worked. <laughs> I yeah. remember I took my time. L but then again, I'm a visual learner. So, so how did you take your time when you happened. have little time to react? Well, Brett, again, I, like I was trying to say, I, I'm a visual learner, so I memorize the patterns. Oh. Makes sense to me. Yeah. It'll take me about two, maybe three times, and then I pretty much got it down. Hey, hey. Hey, hey Brett. What? Right in the booth. I love you. I love right you, too. Booth. God damn it! <laughs> I love you, too. Mwah. Mwah. Hey, hey, folks. If we can make fifty dollars, Brett will do something. Oh my God! What? Uh, what's something embarrassing that you will let that you will do on stream? <laughs> I already wore a dress, so. What, Bliss? You already wore a dress. I I was not embarrassed in that. <laughs> I would say you should wear my Harley Quinn dress, but no, I don't want that to get stretched out. Yeah, let's not do that. Oh. Oh, you sound disappointed, uh, Zach. A little. Oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> no, um... Nope, I'm not doing that. Oh, shit! Oh my god, no, I am not getting that this time. Fuck that. Okay, how about this? If we reach $50, why don't you make a video on your channel reviewing Donkey Kong Country? I already have plans of, like, doing, like, a video game-related oh. series. Well, I mean, just, like, a quick thoughts thing. Well, they're really, like... It, it's gonna be, like, they're, my, my opinion is gonna be pretty much echoing everybody else's. Okay, okay, God, you're hard to work with. Um... I'm a back. Is that yeah, better back. with this shit than I am? Hey, Al, why are you shaking your flake in the chat? Whoa, shit, What someone... is the cartoon creature that's- <laughs> Oh, come on! ...for kids? Run. When I was a kid, um, it, it wasn't really a cartoon. I, I, I was a young kid, so keep in mind, the Pokemon, like, red-blue series, the ghost, wow. that scared the living shit out of me, because I had no internet back then, and I, I thought my game was hacked. <laughs> okay, okay, how about this, Brett? If they reach, like, $35, uh -huh. you'll make a vector of your OC dressed up as Diddy Kong. Or yes! Candy Kong! Oh, God! Diddy Kong? No, no, no. Candy no, Kong. it's gotta be... No. It's gotta be him... No. It's gotta be Golden Fox as Donkey Kong and me as Diddy Kong. <laughs> yeah, because you get the hat... Shit! I think that's it's doable. it's because you want the hat, huh, Tune? Dude, Diddy Kong is a sweet ass hat. <laughs> and he likes to swing around. <laughs> All right. Do you think thirty-five is fair? Yeah. Whoa. Well, there you go, guys. And if you if you, if you get thirty-five, you get don you get Donkey Fox and and Diddy Tune. That'll be a nice little addition Diddy. to have for a thumbnail. <laughs> I like it. Oh come Let's... on. Uh, I'm supposed to be working on an art piece. Do you have yeah, you're, you're, on the art piece. You're doing what's called a break, Bliss. You're doing social interaction. Uh, what is this go, 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 monstrosity? Go, go, go. I should be working. Monstrosity. Aeon, do me a favor, sit on her. No! Okay. You would be cranky. No, 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 um, no, 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 yeah, and why would be uh, cranky? Would, would Bliss yeah. be uh, 
who's the other who's the girl of the DK crew? Tiny that, Kong. Yeah, yeah, she would be Tiny Kong. Oh my god, it works with the name. Rainbow Dash Band uh, 26, I cannot access any N64 games. At least not at the moment. Yeah. <sighs> Bliss and, is Tiny Kong, really? Okay, yeah. so now this begs a question. If we're do going off of DK64 crew, so that's Tiny. Now, who is Lanky? Will. Will could be Lanky Kong, that works. Oh my god. Who could be now Chunky? That just begs Chunky? Uh... Silver Quill? Mm, I was thinking <laughs> Joey. Silver, Silver would be Cranky Con, maybe like no, uh, the old either. guy. Who would be Funky? <laughs> funky, I can't believe I got those two names. Funky, funky Kong. Uh, let me. Space Dandy would be Funky Kong. That can, too. Who's can, Space Dandy? It, it's an anime. Can Aeon be Funky Kong? Aeon, do you want to be Funky Kong? I don't know what that means. He's a character funny, in the. Um, funky. He's a he's a character. Oh God, in... he. That that character looks like friggin' Sapphire, something stop talking cat over would be. people. Anyway, yeah, Sapphire, try not to talk over people. Yeah. Anyways, uh, Funky Kong is one of the me uh, five members of the characters in um, Donkey Kong sixty four. He's big and he's like muscular, and he plays a uh, what is it called the triangular thing mm -hmm. for a solo. Like every character has triangle. like. Triangle. <laughs> every character you has mean a triangle. Yeah. <laughs> Sorry. No, you're thinking of Chunky, who plays the uh, the triangle. Okay, fuck. Okay, Chunky, Funky. Okay, now those names are gonna really mix me up. <laughs> God damn it! Class Chunky, the oh, Funky no, no, Monkey. No, here's, the, here's the thing. We'll start the thing with, at like thirty with with Don with Donkey Tune, and every ten dollar increment we add another member of the crew. Here's an idea. Um. Yes. Let's yeah, do like, that. I like okay, that. so, uh, babe, if you want me to talk about video games, um, I can make, uh, I could do like a short vlog explaining my experience of uh, certain games. That, like, I mean, that's what I was going to say. That was what you were going to do in the first place. Interesting. But I'm doing something that shows your vector work is also fun, and that's why I'm saying thirty bucks, you get a vector of of Donkey Box. And then, and then, with every ten dollar increment, they can Whoa, add. Shit. They could add another member of the DK crew. Oh, damn it! Okay, um, because I had thoughts about like putting together a vlog series explaining like certain games of why I don't like them. Like it's your stream. You pick what your rewards are. Oh, okay. Um, we're just suggesting stuff. Okay. I didn't upset you, did I? No, I'm just tired. Okay. Huh. I drank two monsters in one night yesterday what? and my body doesn't like me for it. That was bullshit. I was right on top of that bastard. Uh-huh. Uh. <sighs> this guy's a pain in the ass. It sounded like You're you sneezed. It's kind of cute. We just make that a thing if Golden is angry, he sneezes now. Yeah. <laughs> wow. It's like, Golden Fox, I put a spell on you to contain your rage. What, what does it do? When you get angry, you'll know. <laughs> And he just has this, like, adorable sneeze. <laughs> yeah, and he stops his rage, and he's just, like, looking, like, blushing, embarrassed, Fuck! and, like, hiding his muscle behind his nose or something. It's like, hey, what did you do? <laughs> A lot of times when he gets mad, he burps. I <laughs> could... <laughs> 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 No, even, no, go even ahead. better yet, it's like someone just says an insult to him and he just looks really angry. It's like, <laughs> <laughs> Did you just burp in my face? What? No, that's the, no, that's what would be the person who got you angry. Okay. Fuck you and fuck you. <laughs> oh, excuse well, you me. Can take me out to dinner first. He <laughs> was excuse. And double fuck you. I'm just blowing through this. Oh, oh shit! Yeah. God, those barrels were moving fast! As fast as your mama. <laughs> oh! Well. Cutest cartoon moment. Um, I'd answer that question, but somebody in this call would get very angry. 
Oh, don't you dare! Don't you dare! I think I will, I will hit I... below the belt, sir. You know I can. I'm small enough to do it. Baku baku nya nya, baku baku nya nya, nayo. That's the cutest a... cartoon moment. Uh, uh, no, I think if we're talking about TV shows and cartoons. I know, I know. I just like I can't really anything think. Anything in Hamtaro. Anything in Hamtaro. Ham ham. <laughs> it was an anime about cute little hamsters. Oh shit! There we go. Whoa! Nice dodge. <laughs> I know. Why this is so cute. Dodge! Don't say that line. Oh god, that line <laughs> it burns in your fucking skull. <laughs> Here's another question. When did you learn to be a fucking asshole? <laughs> oh. Because okay, uh, Zach was quoting off of the uh, that uh, one Atari Jaguar game. Oh okay. Yeah. Where did you learn to fly? Where did you learn to fly? Oh, you're quoting AVGN, okay. Hmm. Ah, uh, what happened? Hmm? Uh, Metal Forge got, uh, timed out. What happened? Uh, it's, I... It's in the, it's what's... In, it's, in the, it's in the Skype chat, the reason. He's right. being a little too... Handsy. Suggestive. Oh, hit, hit. Hang on. Let's... I know you don't mind, but this is Goldie's stream. Yeah, that's true. And I don't he like that. I was saying, if that, I'm just saying, if that was an oh, issue, like, like, don't worry about it. I don't like that behavior towards me either, so yeah. I had, this is the second time I asked him to tone it. Alright. So in the meantime. It is a puppy cow. Oh, God. <laughs> don't launch your pearls at me. A clan that shoots pearls, a real pearl. You know how expensive those things are? Yeah, I'm rich, bitch. <laughs> <laughs> I, I, I had to catch my breath on that one. <laughs> oh, that's adorable. I oh. want to hug it. I love it. And then I want to eat it. it. They're like so sweet and yet so stupid, and I just want to hug them. Yeah, yeah. And then you watch the movie Barnyard. Then, and then you realize you eat burgers. Well, I wouldn't eat my <coughs> pet cow. Well, yeah, you wouldn't eat your pet cow. No, I wouldn't. <laughs> I, I'm sorry, but I just love the. I just love the short bursts of screams. <laughs> God, so many goddamn sharks. This makes Jaws look tame by comparison. Yes, I find a shark! Curl up the butt! I want a picture of Blissey wearing a fake shark fin on her head. Like tied with a string around her chin and stuff. Oh, come on! I was only on the tail end. That's bullshit. Now I'm just gonna not, stay right here. Oh god. Nice save! Nice! <laughs> Crap a doodle! <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> oh god. <laughs> well, babe, you know what to say. So many freaking pearls. I'm rich, bitch. I'm rich, bitch! Oh, damn it. And you got bitch left too. <laughs> <laughs> I got tentacle slapped. Oh, uh, don't say that. Oh, my. <laughs> Chuckle Bucko says Aeon is being suspiciously quiet. Aeon? Peter? <laughs> <laughs> You're being suspiciously quiet, sir. Oh, no, I was thinking about checking to see what was for dinner. Uh. <laughs> I ate lots of food, and now I'm really, really full, and I feel like I need to lay on my back and put my plate. I, I had mashed potatoes, roast beef, and gravy That's with tough. toast. It's it's the ultimate comfort food. I, I forget what it's called, like, specifically the dish name, but that's what you had. That's what I had. Fried chicken, mashed potatoes, or macaroni and cheese. Those are my ultimate comfort foods right there. Oh my Who gosh. is the cutest <laughs> video game character? You're back. 
Crazy. Yeah, Tails. Tails, I Tails think, is so adorable. Tails gets way too much flack, even in the Phantom. Oh, Tails ruined the Sonic franchise. How? What? Yeah. Um, there was a like a cartoon. Show. Damn it. Um, as far back as I can remember, there was a friend of mine named Mental Miles, and he put together like some kind of silly Halloween short where Sonic was uh, trying to get a costume before Halloween started. And um, because it was closed, he uh, decided to kill off uh, Tails, so that way he would wear and try to act like Tails. And the second part, when he's trick-or-treating with a couple of his other uh, friends, uh, somebody like somebody at the door throws candy at him, saying, Tails ruined the Sonic franchise. I'm like, how? I remember, Please do enlighten me. I remember there was this one animated short where it was like, the, it was this entire series of shorts where they showed the dark, public, dark behind the scenes of different beloved uh, fictional characters. They did one for Harry Potter, Mortal Kombat, S Sonic, and Mario. And the Sonic one was Tails was an insane person, and whenever there was an ally that would start to connect with Sonic, <laughs> Tails would kill him. I remember that. I love that. I, I just like... And it was great because the voice of Button Mash was the voice of Sonic. Because <gasps> it was Shady Box. Yeah. Well, like, Tails... I miss Shady Box. Yeah, I do too. No, but back to Tails, like... What do you, miss? What do you mean you miss Shady Box? He does live streams every other day. Really? Oh, okay, yeah, I guess... Yeah, he does, he does live little... streams of him working on music. Oh, okay. So, my, any, my so, so anyway, um... I, um, like, I, I still think that Tails gets way too much flack for, like, I remember that like, Doug Walker said things like he didn't like Tails and such, and I was like, what was wrong with Tails? Like, he didn't really- Shut up, Tails! Well, in the TV shows, he was more, they played up more of his little kid part instead of his prodigy part. That's, like, I do remember an episode of, um, Sonic Sat AM, and it was a very interesting episode where he's like camping out, and it like so it was a really good like moment for him to shine, and like after the show like came to a, a cancellation, the person behind uh, the show, what his plans were for uh, season three, he was gonna downplay Tails. Like, dude, you're wasting good potential for a character. Um, yeah, but uh, you know what Sonic character I want to see them come back, retcon, retool, and. Bring him back into the franchise with a bigger splash. Who? Silver. Hmm. The thing is, he has. Dude, I've been saying that for a long time. Like Silver is a very he underrated character. The whole concept of him being more based around, you know, mind skill and telekinetic skill rather than speed like Shadow and Sonic are. Right. He could be a really cool character, especially with the newer mechanics that video games are able to have nowadays. Like, I can imagine him being a really fun character to play on a game on the Wii U or 3DS where you have the dual screen, and one screen can be for aiming your attacks and stuff as silver. And the interesting could, thing could, is that, really cool. um, if I may say, the interesting thing is if you read the comics, he actually does get a lot. Oh, yeah. I, I remember the uh, one. It was a uh, spin off series for, uh, you know, the Sonic comics. It was like Sonic Universe, I think? Sonic Universe, yes. Yeah, when uh, it, it came to like the future arc, when it came to like a Sonic yeah. Sally, like, and they had like their two kids, Silver was actually a main core mechanic until he got friggin' knocked out in the second issue. Ooh, yeah. It, it was. I, I did oh, enjoy cool. seeing him. Alright, so I just defeated this boss, and I think we're a little bit over 30 minutes off of this one. So, um, how would you guys like another episode tonight? Why not, but yeah. I'm going to leave the Skype call because hearing your voice repeat itself is starting to give me a headache. Oh, it's very disorienting, I know. Anyways, um, anyways, um, I'm going to, um, yeah, so this is going to wrap up for this episode. Again, I hope you guys enjoyed watching this. Until next time, I'm Golden Fox, and keep gaming.